New information in the Aurora shooting case. Breaking this afternoon on the 7 News app, detectives testifying James Holmes searched his computer for the words rational insanity. Prosecutors revealing evidence they say will show he is not insane. 7 News reporter Marshall Zellinger live in Aurora. Marshall, prosecutors think a red light camera there is going to prove their point. A little more than 90 minutes ago, Mike, prosecutors argued why they want a red light camera violation from this intersection of Mississippi and Abilene included into evidence. They say that James Holmes received a red light violation here 10 days before the shooting. They then say 20 minutes later, he went to that Best Buy across the street and bought $600 worth of items, including an iPod touch that was found on him at the shooting. Prosecutors want to show the red light camera violation to prove that his mental state at the time, 10 days before the shooting. Now, also in court, we or before that, we found this photo of the red light violation on the blog, thenewspaper.com. It shows Holmes in the vehicle with the sunglasses on and visor down. His defense attorneys argued this does not prove mental state, saying mentally ill people and those who are legally insane can operate motor vehicles. Earlier today in court, we heard a detective testify that a forensic analysis of one of Holmes's computers revealed a web search using the words rational insanity. We did the same search, and before today's news headlines posted, the top search revealed a band and an article from the New York Times challenging the insanity defense when John Hinckley was on trial for shooting President Reagan. The detective also testified finding web-related searches for weapons, firearms, ammunition, and movie theaters. Another reason that prosecutors want to use this red light ticket violation from 10 days before the shooting, they also want to prove ownership of the vehicle because again, the morning of the shooting, that same white car was found in the back of the theater where James Holmes was arrested. Reporting live in Aurora, Marshall Zellinger, 7 News.